In this video we will talk about nitrogen mustards, their physical and chemical properties, history, and what it are used for in today's world. The chemical name for nitrogen mustard is mechlorophytamine. It contains 5 carbons, 11 hydrogens, 2 chlorines and 1 nitrogen. It's an organic compound, containing functional groups such as amine and alkene. Its physical properties include Toxic gas which is a melting point, 108 to 110 degrees Celsius, and a boiling point of 87 degrees Celsius. It is highly water soluble, and has a pH of 6.43. It is also a colorless compound with a fishy, musty, soapy or fruity smell. Soldiers exposed to mustard gas in World War II, developed reduced numbers of white blood cells in the blood. This led to the use of nitrogen mustard as an anti-leukemic drug. Nowadays nitrogen mustards are used in the process of chemotherapy, which is used to treat cancer. Unfortunately this treatment has negative effects as it can't really distinguish between cancer cells and healthy cells in the human body. Once in the body mechlorophytamine undergoes internal molecular changes to form an aziridinium ion, which contains a three-membered ring. The aziridinium ion is a strong electrophile, which reacts with nucleophilic sites in the DNA. The DNA base, guanine has a nucleophilic nitrogen that reacts with the aziridinium ion formed from the nitrogen mustard, this is followed by the formation of a second aziridinium ion. When the two DNA strands are linked together cell division is stopped, and the cell dies. This approach was used to treat cancer but there is no distinguish between cancer and healthy cells. This causing unpleasant side effects. Some of the side effects, as a result of chemotherapy are, a decreased white blood cell count, which increases the risks of infection, decreased protella count with increased risk of bleeding, anemia, low red blood cell count, with symptoms like tiredness, paleness, or trouble catching your breath, nausea and vomiting, taste changes, decreased appetite, hefting or loss, including hair on the face and body, fetal changes if pregnancy occurs while taking chlorotamin and short-term or long-term infertility. A nitrogen mustard's a drug, or a poison?